Hey guys, so today I came home and I had my swap box uh, waiting for me here from Melissa in Australia. So I just wanted to show you guys what she sent me really quick. Um, I'm going to try to not like make this video take forever. Um, it's getting really late here and I'm tired and I want to get this up so you guys can see because I know a lot of you are interested in seeing what she sent me. This was an awesome, awesome box. She was worried for some reason that I wasn't going to like it, which was, I don't know, I guess there's just like, you know, you always are worried that people aren't going to like what you send to them, but I loved it. So, so she sent me first this cute little card and it has these really super cute little, little friends on it. I love, love, love it. It is so cute. It's it says right here, I don't know if you can see it, it says, We Love Sweets Time. It's so cute. Um, you know, just had a little note talking about our swap and stuff inside it. So, um, <sighs> one thing really quick. When I was unwrapping all of my things, I totally fell in love with this paper. Um, sh this little thing is so cute. I don't know if this is like a... A character, a normal character or whatever. I've never seen this character before, but to me she kind of looks like a female version of Eeyore, you know, from Winnie the Pooh. So, I don't know. Maybe maybe she is, and you guys could tell me if you've seen her before. Let me know. She's, I love her. So, so cute. Um, speaking of cute, she also sent me this little guy. Um, I, I had no idea what he was, but I did think he was really cute. He's so soft. Um, I had to ask her what he was, and she said he was a wombat. So he's really cute. We definitely don't have wombats here. <laughs> we have regular bats, and they're not as cute as this. <laughs> but he's really sweet, and I like him a lot. I'm going to have to think of a really good Australian name for him. If you have any suggestions, let me know. Um what we're going to name him. He is a boy though. I decided that. He looks very masculine. So he needs a boy name. <laughs> okay. Um, from there I found these and as you can see I completely hated them. <laughs> Just kidding. We ate them while we were waiting for our dinner to be, um, while we were waiting for our dinner to cook. And funny thing is these kind of tasted like the next thing that I'm going to show you. However, they were amazing. I love these. Um, they're all natural, no artificial colors, no artificial flavors, and very, very tasty. They were like little fruit chews things. Um, so when I got my box out of, when I got my box when I came home, I instantly knew that there was something from Lush in there because I could smell it. I know the smell from anywhere. And, um, these kind of tasted like how this smells. Kind of weird, but I mean, I would, I understand. that This smells delicious, and these are delicious, so it worked out. Anyways, so this is the Candy Mountain Bottle Bar. It looks like this, if you've never seen one before. It smells so good. And I got this Forever New brush case holder, and it has... Um, whoops, okay, I'm going to turn that mirror around real quick. It has brushes inside, <sighs> and these are like really nice, so soft. Uh, you have four brushes total, two face brushes and two eye brushes, and I can't wait to try these out tomorrow morning. Anyways, there's also a huge, this whole side on the other side is a big huge mirror. I'm not going to blind you with the light from that, so um, use your imagination. It's a mirror. Everybody knows what a mirror looks like. And this I was so excited for. It is so cute. This is a um, Lip Jam Moisturizing Lip Balm, and it looks like a little, like a jam jar. <laughs> so, so, so cute. I got mine in the flavor Peach, and it smells so good. Um... The texture is a little different than I had expected it to be. As you can see, I've already had my fingers in here a few times. Um, it feels really nice. It's not sticky. 
Ugh, and it just smells awesome. So cute. I was so excited for that. I got this um, Face of Australia nail polish. Really pretty pastel blue. This is called Once Upon a Blue Moon. Um, it was really pretty. Uh, it's going to be awesome in the spring, which is going to be here in like three days because I live where it's hot all the time. And then I got this Ulta 3 Pro Nail Polish. This one doesn't have a color or a shade number. It's just like a pretty pink. And I don't know if Ulta 3 is related to the Ulta here in the States because um, the Ulta that I go to used to be called Ulta 3 like years ago. So I don't know if that's a coincidence or if they're like sister stores maybe? I don't know. I might have to look into that just out of curiosity. Next thing I got was this Kate uh, lip gloss. Super cute little signature and it is a beautiful beautiful color. I love this color. This reminds me of my one of my favorite MAC colors that was discontinued. So that's really cool. And my, mine is in number three. And then another lip product I got was this Napoleon. This is in the color Wild Orchid. And it's just really pretty. Like, I don't know if my camera is even going to pick it up. It's like a really pretty orchid color. And it has glitter in it. I'm not usually a huge fan of glitter. However, I did put this on. And it looks more shiny than glittery. So it's a really pretty color. And then I got this little sample of, I don't know how to say the name, but it's Skin Recovery Cream for dry and sensi sensitive skin, which I definitely have. Um, it's a pretty good size sample. It smells really good. I put a little on my hand. It feels really nice. So I'm excited to see how I like that. And then I got this Pacifica um, Persian Rose salt Perfume Solid. And it just looks like, you know, a little little tin that you, you know, wipe and then you put it on your wrist or your neck or whatever. It smells so good. It smells just like fresh roses. It's all natural. And it says it's made with coconut and soy wax, which is awesome because I love coconut. Um, coconut oil and coconut wax. So, awesome. Then I got this really cute Minnie Mouse um, eyelash holder. I guess, and you put your lashes in here, and it just keeps them all really safe. I'd seen her. Um, I've seen I've seen Melissa like post other ones of these. I was really surprised to get the Minnie Mouse one. I do like Minnie Mouse. Okay, then I got this um, more soap at little tin, and I don't know what the smell what smell this one is. Um, I would say the smell is called Fantastic because it does smell really good. It's really cute. Um, little tin and inside it is this beautiful paper that wraps the most glorious scented soap. I can't even tell you. Oh, it smells so good. Like I don't even... Mm. I almost want to like put it in my drawer so that my drawer smells like that. It just smells so good. I love this. Oh hey, then I got this I Like eyeshadow palette with nine colors. Nine amazing colors. I love all of them. And I like how small this is to hold nine colors. It's really um, a great little palette. It feels really sturdy. I don't feel like it's going to break. Oh, I got this really cute, super cute little like old school looking makeup bag. I love the pattern and the colors are really, really cute. Um, it's a very good sturdy makeup bag and it's going to be easy to wash off when I get my makeup all over it because I will definitely be be using this. It's going to be great. Um, I guess it's made by Comfy. And then the next three things are from the um, Kors Limited Edition Love Your Lips Collection. I took them out of the packaging so I could show you. Um, I got this um, Lip Butter Glaze in Jasmine Moisturizing. 
And then I got um, a number 28 liquid lipstick. Kind of matches my shirt. <laughs> really pretty color. And then I got um, the lip butter in jasmine as well. <laughs> Just a couple more things here, guys. Next, I got the Model & Co. Lip & Lash Collection. And it looks like this. Really pretty colors. Um, there's the lip, a lipstick up here, and then a lip gloss. And they look... Obviously, I'll just show you one, and then I'll show you the mascara. Here's the mascara here. It just looks like a normal, you know... Actually, has a really awesome-looking brush. So, anyways, back to these. <clears throat> so, you take off the top cap... And it rolls up like, like kind of like a crayon. And then on the bottom, which is now on the top, you have a corresponding lip gloss. That, that one like was really sticky for some reason. Anyways, so that's really convenient. Uh, and last but not least is my favorite thing that I got in this um, swap. And I remember talking to her about this, and she showed it to me on the on the computer, and I was like totally in love. And it's the Australia's eyeshadow palette, and this is in Totes Smokin', which is really funny because I say Totes a lot, like you know, instead of totally, which is stupid, but I say it all the time. <clears throat> and let me show you. So this is what the packaging looks like. It reminds me of my favorite sleek products. It's nice, it has a color coded on the back. And it has a huge mirror. This whole thing right here on the other side is a huge mirror. I'm not going to show you the mirror. <clears throat> but here's the colors. Um, so pretty. This color here is amazing. And I'm really excited to wear this. This palette looks awesome. So I loved everything that you sent to me and as you can tell my voice is starting to slip away because I've been chatting too much. But anyways, thank you so much for this swap. You had no reason to be nervous whatsoever and I can't wait for you to get my box. Um, I hope you would do a video. I know you used to do videos. So I don't know if you still do. But if you do, Melissa, please do a video. Um, and then you could show everybody all the things I sent to you. And I love my box, and thank you so much. I hope you have a great night. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. Bye!